I think that uh, one is so used to their hypocrisy that these sorts of things um, aren't too surprising. I mean, but it doesn't make any sort of sense when even just a few days ago, Harry was complaining about his upbringing, complaining about his family, and, and then you want to give your kid a title that means they are, as you said, attached to that family. I mean, he wanted to get away. He wanted to get far away from it, have his freedom. Um, and I think it's um, very strange. You know, they say one thing and do another. I think it's a snobby thing, really, that she will have this title and everyone will see that she's different from... But actually, is children. it a shame? I'm sorry, but is it a shame for little Lilibet? Because if they have it their way, then everyone around them in Montecito will think that the royal family is a horrifically racist institution with ties to slavery and everything that's bad in the world. And now, when they introduce their daughter to all of their friends as a princess... They will know, won't they, that their daughter has links to horrific things like the slave trade and crimes around the world. And that can't be nice for your little girl. No. I mean, every little girl wants to be a princess of some sort, but they want to do it for a party and then take it all off and um, be normal little girls. But I think it could be very embarrassing for her at school where people would make fun of her because she doesn't know any, she will have know nothing about the royal family. She won't have got involved in it. And it's just a burden. I mean, I wonder whether it's part of Harry and Meghan's attempt to have a sort of woke alternative royal family that they're going to now build up um, with themselves and other people. I've been thinking this for a long time and whenever the royal family have an occasion they do something to try and outsmart it and this would be yet another way of setting up their own um, family royal and I think it's very concerning actually.